हेलो फ्रेंड्स माय नेम इज रजनीश मौर्या एंड माय कलीग इज राहुल मौर्या टुडे वी आर हियर टू प्रेजेंट आर एमडी कोर्स प्रोजेक्ट डिजाइन ऑफ कार्ट मैकेनिज्म नीड टू डिजाइन अ कार्ट मैकेनिज्म व्हिच ऑपरेट्स एट 960 आरपीएम टू लिफ्ट 10 किलो न्यूटन ऑफ सिंथेसिस फर्स्ट इज पावर स्क्रू इट कन्वर्ट्स रोटरी मोशन इनटू लीनियर मोशन इट इज कॉम्पैक्ट इन डिजाइन सेकंड इट इज वर्म गियर ड्राइव द मेन एडवांटेज ऑफ वर्म गियर ड्राइव is it is self locking and high speed reduction ratio bearing the bearing is used to support shaft and smooth working of the shaft selection of material for screw we are selecting plain carbon steel for nut we are selecting grey cast iron for worm alloy steel 40 ni cr mo 28 for worm wheel chilled bronze material design of power screw step 1 calculating pitch diameter of screw that is dp dp is greater than equal to under root of pitch into s upon pi into xi into t into z into pressure where pressure is 8 newton per millimeter square for solid nut xi equal to 1.85 t equal to 0.5 times of pitch and the dp that is pitch diameter is coming out to be 22 mm now from phg 5.73 selecting next higher value for core series that is diameter of bolt is 26 mm uh, core diameter is 18 mm nut die is 25.5 mm and pitch equal to 8 mm let us select screw for self locking 10 beta equal to s upon pi into pitch diameter where s equal to 12 and beta equal to 6.6 degree where beta is helix angle friction angle rho equal to 7 degree here our helix angle that is beta is less than friction angle so our design is safe step 2 calculating total torque of screw based on uniform pressure theory that is by calculating all parameters total torque required to overcome screw friction that is t1 equal to 122.87 10 raised to 3 newton millimeter torque required to overcome call of friction That is T2 equal to 63.46 into 10 raised to 3 newton millimeter. Therefore, total torque T equal to T1 plus T2. Therefore, T equal to 192.33 into 10 raised to 3 newton millimeter. Design of nut. Step three: calculating outer diameter of nut. Here, ultimate strength equal to 235 newton per millimeter square, and factor of safety equal to 18. Therefore, sigma T equal to 13.05 newton per millimeter square, and the diameter is coming out to be 45 mm. Step four: height of nut. Z equal to h upon pitch diameter. Therefore, where z equal to 1.25 and pitch diameter is 25 mm. Therefore, height is coming out to be 45 mm. Step five: Checking circumferential shear of nut by thread of screw. P equal to pi into d naught into thickness of thread into number of threads into sigma s, where p equal to 10 kilo newton. Therefore, the circumferential shear is coming out to be 6.13 newton per millimeter square. Our circumferential shear is less than design circumferential shear. Therefore, our design is safe against circumferential shear. Design of worm gear drive. Step one: General assumption. Reduction ratio is 20 is to 1. Considering speed of prime mover, selecting six pole simple motor where n1 equal to 960 rpm. Step two: Calculating output speed. I equal to n1 upon n2 where n2 equal to 960 divided by 20. Therefore, n2 equal to 48 rpm. Step three: Assumption based on worm gear. selecting single envelope because of low velocity ratio second pressure angle equal to 20 degree third quality of gear is carefully cut gears type of gearing is sn gearing step 4 deciding number of starts on worm z is greater than equal to 40 upon i plus 1 where i equal to 20 therefore z equal to 2 step 5 number of teeth on worm wheel z2 equal to i into z There was Z two equal to forty. Assuming Q equal to eleven, step six, calculating lead angle and helix angle. There gamma equal to ten point three. That gamma is lead angle. Therefore, helix angle equal is beta equal to ninety minus gamma. That is coming out to be seventy nine point seven degree. Step seven, calculating virtual number of teeth. 
the virtual number of teeth that is Z1 for worm is 349.87 and the virtual number teeth for worm wheel is 41.99. Step 8. Calculating Lewis form factor capital Y equal to pi into 0.154 minus 0.192 upon ZV where ZV is virtual number of teeth and Y is Lewis form factor. For worm y equal to 0.4756 and for worm wheel the Lewis form factor y equal to 0.4155 step 9 selecting suitable material for worm gear drive for worm selecting alloy steel 40 ni 2 cr mo28 the ultimate strength equal to 15500 kgf per centimeter square and the design context stress equal to 11000 kgf per centimeter square for worm wheel we select material Chilled bronze, ultimate strength equal to 3,900 kgf per centimeter square, and design context stress equal to 1,100 kgf per centimeter square. Step 10: Deciding the weaker element. Beam strength is directly proportional to ultimate strength into Lewis form factor. For worm, the beam strength is 7371.8, and for worm wheel, beam strength is 1620.45. Therefore. The weaker element is worm wheel, so we design for worm wheel. 11. Calculation for center distance and model. Since torque is 192.33 Newton meter, power equal to 2 pi nt by 60. For n equal to 48 rpm, the power equal to 0.199 kilowatt. For center distance, the formula of A is given, and by substituting all the values, the a is coming the center distance a is coming out to be 18.71 cm so module mx equal to 0.73 cm 12 checking the tooth for bending failure sigma b equal to 556.16 kgf per cm square so our induced bending stress is less than design bending stress so our design is safe step 13 nomenclature for worm reference diameter D1 equal to 8.03 cm Tip diameter DA1 equal to 9.49 cm Root diameter DF1 equal to 6.132 cm Pitch diameter D equal to 8.03 cm Length L equal to 9 cm For worm wheel reference diameter D2 equal to 29.2 cm Root diameter DF2 equal to 27.33 cm Pitch diameter D equal to 29.22 cm Tip diameter DA2 equal to 30.66 cm Now design of bearing Here load P is equals 10 kN Assuming LH is equals 10,000 hours and 90% reliability Where L is equals 16N into LB upon 10 ratio 6 where n is equals 960 rpm and l is equals 576 million revolution now and the formula is l l by 1 l by 10 is equals ln of 1 by p upon ln of 1 by p naught is equals l10 is equals 575.75 million revolution where l10 is equals c by p to the power 3 where c is equals 8319.13 kg of centimeter Based on previous calculation of dynamic load carrying capacity C is equals 8319.13 kg of centimeter, we selected deep groove ball bearing with escape number 6412. Here, inner diameter D is equals 60 mm, abutment diameter of shaft is equals 74 mm, outer diameter D is equals 150 mm, abutment diameter of bearing D2 is equals 136 mm, and width of bearing B is equals 35 mm. Now we are doing analysis part. The analysis of worm gear drive, we found that design is safe against one misses stress. Here is the analysis of power screw and frame. Here is a little drawing of cart lifting mechanism, which includes worm wheel, nut, power screw, frame, radial bearing, thrust bearing, motor, worm.